Next week, the eyes of the sports world will descend on the desert where the 49ers and Chiefs will face off in Vegas. The Indianapolis Colts won't be there, but their number one fan will be. WRTV's Griffin Gonzalez tells us about the 2023 Colts Fan of the Year and how she carries her love for the shoe into the classroom. Marin Johnson has loved the Colts since she was just a kid. I was probably in like fourth or fifth grade. Um, very vividly remember walking up to the RCA Dome, wearing my Jim Harbaugh jersey. While a student at UND, Marin would use her extra time to work concessions at the old RCA Dome just to get a glimpse of the Colts. Things I remember is just like watching Bob Sanders run up and down like during warmups when nobody was in the dome or watching Peyton throw passes and just having those moments as a fan. And her fandom came full circle a few weeks ago. I can't think of anyone who bleeds bluer than you. I heard a whisper and I turned around and just was full of joy, happy tears, and and they told me the honor of being the fan of the year and that I was going to the Super Bowl. Next Sunday, Marin will get to watch a champion be crowned. But Marin, she cheers on champions every day. What is your favorite part about coming to school every day and working with Miss Johnson? Everything. You can say, like, I am a fan of the... So I am an occupational therapist. Um, as an OT, you can work in any setting. Specifically, I work here in the schools and um, I help students that might not know how to hold their pencil. They don't have the finger hand strength to maintain that grasp that they need so they can be independent in writing their spelling words, writing their math work. She cheers for the shoe almost as much as she cheers for her students at Southeastern Elementary School in Fishers. Yeah. Do I always like to be their cheerleader, so just the fan in me from, you know, when I was young watching my brother play t-ball till now. I have all these kids and I get to be their cheerleader and it's fun just rooting them on. For Marin, it's about building the foundation for these kids to go the distance. And it's been awesome just to see their growth and maturity and how they don't need to always use the supports in place um, because they've learned to use them when they need to and they um, have continued to be more independent. Marin Johnson, a loyal fan, cheering on her teams. It is a great, great career that I've loved and I'm proud to be an OT. Reporting in Fishers, Griffin Gonzalez, WRTV News. Well, Marin is in the running to be the NFL Fan of the Year. Fans can vote for until February 7th. For more information, that's available right now at WRTV.com.